Anthony here at WPPI 2018 Conference in Las Vegas, Nevada, and I'm talking to Dixie Dixon, well-known fashion photographer, works with Nikon and other companies. Welcome, Dixie. Hi, thank you. It's so good to see you again. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for giving the time. What's new yeah. with you? Well, I have been super busy. Um, I just did a video project in Hawaii oh. um, and just been shooting a lot of commercial companies, yeah. um, a lot of advertising, and I just released a book, actually. Okay. Yeah, so it's on fashion and lifestyle photography uh -huh. and how to break into that commercial industry that's so elusive and so hard to break into. Oh, so it's not only photos, but it's tips as yes, well. Yes, absolutely. Tips on how to do better fashion photography, yeah, right? Yeah, absolutely. So maybe you can tell us uh, the first few mm -hmm. things you could share in yeah. terms of uh, tips for fashion photographers coming up? Absolutely. I think the main thing is to really discover your style and to shoot a ton of images and figure out what you love to shoot most and then focus on that and really try to post only the work that you're really passionate about because you're going to start attracting those types of clients. So that's the first thing. Um, very um, important to be um, on Instagram and all these social media tools. It's really great for photographers starting out. Right. and what, uh, master what, your, your gear. What about in terms of equipment? What do you yes. suggest? What, where do you want to start? Ooh, where do you want to start? I mean, currently I'm shooting with the Nikon D850 and I love that camera, but you could start out with something a little bit, you know, like a DSLR, like the D5600, which is a really good tool to start with. I mean, the cameras today make some, some great images. Okay, so what do you primarily use in terms of lenses? Of lenses? Yeah. So I am a prime lens shooter. I actually don't even own any zooms. Oh. So, uh, believe it or not, I shoot the 58 millimeter a lot. The 105 millimeter is a uh -huh. great portrait lens. I think one it's my eight, favorite. One eight, one four. Yes, one four. Uh -huh. Ideally, but if you want to save on some money, you can get the one eight, which is also great. Okay. But the 105 and the 58 are two of my favorite portrait lenses. Right, and yeah. you and you, sh and you have a website, right? I do. Lens. Now the website has mm -hmm. information about your new book. Yes, it does. Okay. Absolutely. What, what would Dixie? Dixon.com? Yep, you yeah. got it. DixieDixon.com. <laughs> hasn't, hasn't changed, right? <laughs> it hasn't changed. Okay, and the book's available uh, worldwide on Amazon. Right. Yeah. And uh, so you're here at the show where you're going to be speaking. Yeah. What kind of topics are you going to be talking about? Absolutely. So I'll be speaking at the Nikon booth um, a lot on lighting because lighting is one of my biggest passions. And I'll also be sp speaking at the Skyloom booth on their new software called yeah. Luminar. Yeah. So editing the fashion images to really give an oomph to your photos. Right. That's my next question. Yeah. Is, uh, do you do most of your editing? Mm -hmm. You I, do. I do the final parts of it. So I outsource a lot of my retouching because the retouching on the skin takes so long um, but then I like to do the final you know edits like the color and the saturation and all those things right yeah. now uh, here's a question yeah. uh, which shot you you regret not getting Ooh, that's hard <laughs> <laughs> I know. which shot do I regret not because I could tell you the ones really? I can you know, I can remember oh I should have had that should have had this oh my goodness it's always for me I'm really really crazy about focus and I always like that Sharpness. that tight focus on the eyes uh -huh. and if I kind of missed it or I accidentally yeah, focus on an yeah, ear or yeah. something it like breaks my heart <laughs> right right so it's usually that kind of thing and so do you how long does it stay with you that that, that you feeling got, that you didn't get it right exactly <laughs> it stays with me a little while right? I am yeah I can huge tell. perfectionist yeah I, I can tell I can tell yes. you I just say I'm obsessive that way yes and, and lenses today are pretty sharp they are they and are insanely could, sharp and you can yes. make it sharper, but it's your job in front of the camera, mm -hmm. behind the Absolutely. camera, to get it right the first time, right? Yes. Yeah. And I think the the part of I always will compose the image first, and then move my focus point to the eyes. So I use single point focus, uh -huh. and that kind of allows me to get that really tack sharp focus. The only challenge I have is when the models are moving. Sometimes it's a little tricky. So that's usually when I experience the how, you know how, how normally. <laughs> Because, you know, the big, the setup for a shoot is longer right. than, than the actual shots. It is. That's so true. Yeah. So how yeah. long does it take you to set up? Ooh. You know, sometimes we're in pre-production like a month in, in advance. Really? Yes. Because we have about 20 people on set on a lot of different kinds of shoots. So it's like advertising. You have the client. You have the art director and all these different people. Um, but sometimes shoots come together in a week. So it really just depends on what the, their deadline is. And you're all over the world. Yeah. Yes. Right? Good <laughs> I am. Right? Yes. Wow, that's it's great. been so much fun. Yeah. And you started uh, 
I don't I forgot the story, but you started young. Yeah. And then you broke, what was your big break? I think my big break was honestly shooting for this TV show um, on HDNet. It was like a docu-reality travel show um, where I got to photograph swimsuit models, yeah. <laughs> of all things, um, for four years. Wow, that's So, fantastic. yeah kind of discovered my style during that time. Okay, well, yeah. continue success. Yeah, thank and thanks you. for your time. I really, I really appreciate it. it. Nice to see you again. It's good to see you too.